Alrighty, welcome to the Noku Defensive. Now we need to do three quests. Good, you are here. I welcome Onara's rage. When the winds are still, I will suspect the worst. The Tirai, Shikar, and Onir clans must rally to free her and defeat Balakar Khan. I can spare no hunters for the Kanamatra now. Focus fire! The proto-dragon Granith was nearly in our grasp when Balakar's warriors ambushed us. We must retake our weapons Let's of war fly! and drive the Nokut back. When Granith's I'm not blood beginning before we have ground, it our no purposes way. can align. Wait, or you die. Let fly! Keep retaking the weapons! Two more remain! Focus fire! This is why I love Death Knights. They're just pulling all the enemies to one spot so we can easily cleave them. Having a Death Knight in the group, even so many years after Wrath of the Lich King release, is still good. Focus fire! <laughs> To the final weapon! Your target. Focus fire! has turned! The weapons are ours! Worthless! I will dispose of the outsiders myself! Granith has landed! Strike now! Again, if you play tank, always look out for the mana of your healer. You never know how much they can. Your sky darkens! I mean, optimally you have a UI that's needed to telling you the healer needs mana. But I'm too lazy to add that, so I don't have that. Or primal power! Ready to fire! Can you stand against my might? Incarnates! See! Oh, oh, that's a strong trinket. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But then again, I don't want to waste the stamina. I'm a tank. I kind of need stamina.
Taking damage has a low chance to grant you a shield, absorbing 50,000 damage, and increasing your armor by 600 while the shield holds. The shield explodes when broken, dealing 10,000 physical damage split between all nearby elements. Oh, the storm must nice. be quieted and the elemental within it defeated before Clan Omir can join the Kanamatra. Their primalist allies have placed totems that protect this raging tempest. Find them and destroy them. Truly a blasphemous idol. Continue your work. The Primalist's power weakens. One more totem, quickly! The final totem crumbles. Now take down the Avatar of the Storm! Should we make a bet whether or not they're going to pull that trash bill? Oh boy. I mean, if we're fast enough, it won't happen. Increased. Interesting, okay. And 42 oh so we need a heck load of item level before we can do heroic instances i need 50 higher item level oh boy clan ukel has allied with clan nokud today they will regret that alliance i am the messenger of death
messenger of death. Subjectively, I have the feeling that I'm not receiving enough heal. Which is odd since it's a paladin. A paladin should have no problem with single target tank healing. I mean, a paladin is literally the best single target healer you have, at least as far as I know, no, from Shadowland. I, I don't speak for Ancestors! I am the messenger of death! the heal not upping these people? Is he lazy? Is he okay? hmm. This is what has become of our legacy? You shall pay for this blasphemy with your lives! Flee before me! Guides my arrows. Flee before me. Away from him. Peace at last. Protect my children. Balakar Khan is beyond mercy. Clan Tirai will join our Khan at Nokudan Hold. It seems that the legs are gone. Which is kind of nice. entrance let's try that one i mean they're going to the main entrance i'm not sure why but when the healer arrives uh, that doesn't really matter i can just go through here with the death knight i'm out of range <laughs> Nobody's here. <laughs> I mean, okay, the add-on is new, the map is new, but um, 
as a basic action you should always um, follow your tank so the tank is the one leading the group he decides where you attack and where you go so if damage dealer doesn't care where the tank is then that's the problem with the damage dealer and not of the tank the only thing that the tank needs to do is care for his own cooldowns and care for the mana of the healer the healer has no mana and you're going to make a big pull and everybody dies and yes that's your fault it's too far in that case <laughs> And when in doubt, when you're not sure if it's enough, just ask. Go question mark, and if the healer writes yes or something or plus, then um, go. better to ask. Um, and yeah, fucking it up. to death all the time in normal mode even though I have a paladin tank healer I mean what I mean again it's, it's be careful with criticizing healers but in this case my goodness ha! I will use Onara's power for more than breezes and blessings my storm will bring forth a mightier Maruk greatness awaits us This side path definitely better than the main entrance. It's much more complicated in terms of enemies. Yeah, I missed it. I have it on Q. It's kind of dangerous to place it there, since obviously on WSD you move. In this case, um, I fucked that one up. But it doesn't really matter in normal mode, but in a mythic or something that would now have been a massive problem. Since that's the main main tank cooldown and um, last boss, yeah, Mythic Plus, you're going to need that. If the eagle will not give you the power, I will take it. This land is our birthright. Ancestors! Ancestors, forgive me! <sighs> Alright, that is right. Yeah, quest fulfilled. Malakar's weapon will be build. broken. Quest for oh no. Place Tira's bow. He will Where not do take I a place, place of honor with the ancestor Khans. Do I have to place it outside? My thanks, outsider. Place the weapons in the tier I could now flies free, and without Balakar's um, influence, I guess I have to place it outside of the dungeon. I hope, since uh, I'm not, go I'm now going to leave it. If I have to place it inside the dungeon and there is no indication on the minimap, then I'm going to hate upon Blizzard. Be rest sure of that. Oh no, oh no, no, that's not, that's not right. Where am I supposed to? Eh? Up there. Okay. Have you eaten? Alright, so we have neck, trinket, strength, shoulder. Yeah, we're definitely going for the shoulder. It's the biggest. Ooh, 50 stamina. Wait, but oh there was my. another. So here we get neck or shoulder. Here we're going to get. Ah, here we're going to get neck. 
So we're going to choose shoulder Daughters here. Of Tira, smile on you. I have many lucky dudes <laughs> you like. Place Tira's bow, but where? You kid, uh, do we dev? We, we wait. Do we have to do it in the dungeon? Are you kidding me? No. Are you serious? But where? I don't understand. I mean, come on. Good, you are here. No, but I where? Onara's rage. When the winds are still, huh? I will suspect the worst. Place the weapons in Terakai Kurgan. The Where's the Terakai Kurgan? And Onir clans must Terakai. rally to free her and defeat Balakar Khan. Huh? Where? Do what must be done to prepare What's the fucking Kurgan? Our combined forces will meet outside Ugh, I hate these kind of quests. Home. There is no indication on the minimap that I'm supposed to do anything. Terakai Kurgan. I'm going to, to reach them Google quickly. it. Place their weapons in the Terakai Kurgan. What the fuck is the Terakai Kurgan? Okay, no, no, no trackers. Go away. Okay. Comments 13. Um, kill Terra and Maruk in the dungeon, then back in open world. Ah, okay. But why is the game telling me to go into the dungeon? Odd. Okay. Then in open world, Terakai Onajan planes fly point and place bow and spear on graves. Ah, so we have to return to the graves, okay. But it doesn't, which is, that's just odd since the game is not telling me to. I mean, I'm not sure if you're noticing, but um, there is no indication here on the map that I'm supposed, oh, come on, game. what game, why? Why are you doing this? <laughs> now the legs have stopped <laughs> and now the disconnects begin. Oh, Blizzard, get your f servers under control. Again, if this would be a new game, I would have lots and lots of patience and love, but this is an 80-year-old adult veteran of gaming, and I expect after 10 years that the developer finally fix or finds figures out how to properly stabilize servers and blizzard here even after so many years is still not capable of doing that and that's just at some point it becomes a joke simply because so much time has passed if they with all their resources and billions and billions and billions of dollars over the years can't figure it out then nobody can which is ridiculous, and I don't believe that. <sighs> okay. And did the game crash now? Question mark. I'm just seeing this um, symbol from Windows, which says that uh, there's a kind of problem with your game. I could close it now, but no. Wait. Wait until we're probably on the ground already and getting smoshed by by mobs by enemies. We will see how that one turns out. And this is exactly why I don't play Diablo 3 again. It's just hardcore was so much fun. I had no problem at all playing it. And um, but then <laughs> a leg arrives and then you're dead. And then the black game master you to contact. What <laughs> no? Mm? That's exactly why I hate game multiplayer games. Not because of um, other players or the multiplayer part, no, no, the problem is the connection. You see, if I play Spider-Man or Total War Warhammer or something like that, single-player games, I can just easily play through. I mean, okay, if I heavily mod it, sometimes it crashes the game as well. But not because of um, the game inherently being bad. The connection doesn't matter. Oh, we're actually moving now. Oh, ah, now it's infinitely laggy. Now the game doesn't know what to do. Uh, I'm, I'm not doing anything. Ah. Oh, now now I can move again. Okay. Interesting. Alright.
Are you good? Ancestors protect All right. you. Rebellion of the ancestors. Yes. May your arrow nice. always fly true. And now we're going to finish the third quest. And there's actually there is a pin on the world map. Oh, here. Okay. Wait, no. Is it here? No, it's below us. Where is that? Um, is, are there more graves here? Oh, there is. Okay. Spirit, it is good to know Clanted Eye still thrives. You have my gratitude for saving me from fighting against my own people. And Maruk said, Many thanks, friend, for returning me to my rightful resting place. It is good to know the Centaur have more friends than when we first chose to leave our homes. Alright. Um, we still have a problem. Um, since we're still a quest line short of the achievement. Hello. So there's an optional quest line. Goodbye. Uh, at least one. Even though we still have May your arrow one, always fly oh, Thunder Spent Tramper Questline unlocked. Okay. Um, that's nice. Oh, there you are. Okay, so that we're going to do that before we're going to do the trouble with uh, the tie bomb, and we're going to quickly uh, Lawmaster optional, Azure Span optional. Wait, what? Where are the optional quests? Cliffside, Dragon... Uh, oh, now in Plains, there you are. Alright, so Taiwan Purpose, when we've done that. Lilac Ramble still remaining. Now that's not Ry Lilac Ramble. So I need to find out... Rich... Oh, 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 oh. Rich Deposit. Hello there. Thank you. So I still need to find out where Lilac Rumble is. Alright, so we down here. Once again, please. Uh, we should be able to find that one out. Lilac Rumble. World of War. Oh! What the heck? Why are there so many enemies here? Oh. I need to get closer. There are enemies now. Why are they allowed here to, to be here? Interesting. Hmm. Okay, Lilac Ramble questline. How to start Lilac Ramble? Um, yes, yes, yeah, blah, blah, blah. The first step you need to do is take tra <coughs> travel to the Shady Sanctuary. At the coordinates 25, 50, what the heck? 25, 57. 2557. So there. You'll find an NPC called Selena Crunchy Leaves. She'll offer you to start the quest called Find Theramos. Garden Keeper. Okay, so uh, we now know where we're going to find that quest. And now we're going to pet the good doggo um, in the next episode. Oh, who's a good doggy? Ah. My goodness, what big dog. I mean, this is at least a real dog. Not these little pinchers. Who you can accidentally kill by stepping on them. Again, I already said that. I'm not inherently an enemy of small dog breeds. I am an enemy of dog breeds with clear genetic defects that will always arrive and where the animal will suffer from long parts of its life and humans could easily fix that if they would slightly change their aesthetic preferences. For example, a dog without a proper snout can't properly breathe and just don't. Just don't support that. Please don't buy a dog that has no proper snout. If he does not have a proper snout, he can't properly breathe and he will have problems in his life. And that's just totally unnecessary. Anyway. <laughs> 